Man, it's been a hot minute since I've seen this. Except for a couple weeks ago when we played Wolverine. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, we didn't see it. I mean, well. uh, Hi. Oh, it hurts. Oh, oh it hurts. look at it. Oh. Look, look how low quality this looks, but how many hours have people sunk into this game? Welcome to Bargain Bin Lounge. This week we have Bejeweled 2 Deluxe. It's gonna be another nostalgia romp, and uh, how much did you pay for this? I mean, you, I, I think you got this when the 36 store was closing, is that right? Yep, I managed to pick it up while the store was closing for $5. It was half price. It stayed $10 for close to 10 years. That's dedication. So, Pop Cap, you haven't been around for a while. We already played Peggle 2, and that was something from the early days of the 360 store. Good to see you guys. Come back to us. But uh, here we have Bejeweled, a game that I didn't really play a lot of when it was out on PC and when it came to Xbox, I was like, yeah, okay. Seems fun, but I don't get the appeal. I get the appeal now. You just gotta be good at it. Apparently. Well, also, it's kind of one of those, you know, shut your brain off and just play the game with the pretty lights and everything. Is there multiplayer? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, what? How can... The it's two in the title. I mean, how could... We'll just be playing around, you know, just having some fun, jibber-jabbering about the past. I know we all love that. At least I hope we do. Do you like that? Usually. Some people take it too far. Well, let me just say, because I had never played Bejeweled, finally giving it a shot after all these years, I started thinking of, like... The uh, the Xbox Live rooms where you get a bunch of friends together, even people you don't know, and you just play around a Halo or something like that. Mm -hmm. And I was just like, man, I really miss that. <laughs> I really like the 360. I remember uh, buying it in uh, during my high school years. Well, uh, we got to look to the future now because now we have Discord where we have our decent uh, cam uh, mic and camera setups. With our broadband internet connections, that doesn't sound like total ass. I will say, uh, it, it brought me back to where, uh, the first time I ever had Xbox Live, like, legitimately in, uh, I was hooked into the internet. Yeah! Oh, uh, continue. You, you need to get your, your traveling through space and time pants on, man. I'm not used to it, I'm sorry! <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, when Halo 3 came out and I wanted to play online with friends, that was the first time. My dad took a, like, 100-foot Ethernet cable from his <laughs> router upstairs and hooked me, and I was like, I'm in. Finally. That's, that's uh, a lot of times that you've uh, brought up the term 100-foot Ethernet cable. Yeah, because I have one in my apartment. Who do you think I learned it from? <laughs> How often do you need to resort to the uh, to uh, the hundred foot Ethernet cable? Uh, well, mainly just for a direct connection to my PC because you know Wi-Fi is hit or miss. I'd rather just be uh, hardwired in. Because if I had a nickel for every time you brought up the you know the hundred foot Ethernet cable, mm -hmm. I'd have two nickels, which isn't a lot, but it's weird that it happened twice. I don't think we've ever had an opportunity to bring that joke up in conversation and not have it sound forced, that right there was perfection. Thank you, thank you. It's all this is what I'm hearing, yeah. I mean, if you do the Doofenshmirtz voice, it kind of forces it. Yeah. It's like, hey, listen to me, I'm doing the, the Phineas and Ferb joke, don't you get that? Remember, it's fun, ha huh? Space and time! Okay, here we go. So I got used to it, I'm good now. <laughs> I just had to, I just had to... Whew, take get, some Dramamine, you know. You're I had to get my sea legs back, you know. Ready for space travel. My time legs. <laughs> See, now... <laughs> Do you have your time legs? Absolutely. So I actually kind of like the the vibe that uh, PopCap was going for here. It's, it's mainly just like, because it's got like floaty music in there. It's, it's like if you go over to a friend's house and they have like incense burning in the background, it's just like, oh yeah, all right. What vibe? It's, it's, it's just, hey, we got like a shoestring budget. Let's use it to make an addicting game and make like a billion trillion dollars. Listen to the soundtrack. Sit back and enjoy the spacey sounds of a jewel too. It's like I'm watching a documentary. 
and I just fall asleep to it. That's not an insult, by the way. That's just like, yeah. The self-replicating yeah. nature of the jewels <laughs> continue endlessly. As more get destroyed, they are replaced. Sometimes certain reactions take place and fire off different neurons. And then in one time space war run up! You know, I gotta think, the college kid that came up with the algorithm that Bejeweled uses made PopCap millions. <laughs> like, I, I, I knew a few people uh, in college for the short time I was there. They said, oh yeah, I figured out their algorithm. I've already made it up and it's, it's interesting. I just can't do anything with it because PopCap has a stranglehold on this. And oh, I just got a great idea for another burden. Then, uh, speaking of popcap, guys, I'm thinking it'll be a, my, my no, favorite you, popcap. You got one in there? Got one in the chamber? Yeah. All right. Plants vs. Zombies. Oh, that's perfect. Can you find it for five or less? Probably. And then I'll bring Garden Warfare 2. Yeah, because people want, like, you know, Garden Warfare 2, Battle for the Neighborhood or whatever. and Battle for the Neighborhood. Plants vs. Zombies 3, free-to-play nonsense garbage that EA schlocked out. I'm talking about the original. Mm -hmm. Those are some good times, man. See, I actually... Good times. I don't know why I skipped over PopCap for the longest time, because now you just brought back memories of playing Plants vs. Zombies for the first time. I'm, it, my brain was just going, Where were you? <laughs> it was here the whole time, and you didn't even give it a chance. What are you doing, man? Well, yeah, because you're thinking, Oh, the, the Plants vs. Zombies, that sounds pretty cringe, right? Another Zombies game, right? You know, it's like Typing of the Dead, you know? Whatever. And then you realize it's a tower defense game that's really, really good. And the soundtrack is uh, top 20 in gaming history, I'd say. Mm hmm. Man, now you want me going back playing Plants vs. Zombies? How dare you make me want to play games? Well, this is the nostalgia episode, isn't it? Absolutely. I'm always down for nostalgia. I've hit that age, and I'm okay with that. Just makes me realize, like, circa 2006, 2007, it was a good time. I was having fun. That was when I first got my PS2. Nice. I actually got my PS2 late. <laughs> like, I, did, I did too, 2006. Yeah, everybody else had theirs, and uh, my uncle sold me his for like 50 bucks or something like that. What was your first PS2 game? Uh, in a technicality with that sale, it came with GTA 3. Uh, and some sports game, I, I don't remember. I think it was an uh, MLB game. I think mine was Soul Calibur 3. Ooh, good choice, good choice. Quickly followed by the original God of War. Also a very good choice. Uh, now, I will say, because I was a bit of a snob, and I saw that GTA 3, I was like, I'm above this, so I immediately sold it in the MLB game to get Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> like, like a true thespian. <laughs> I have no use for this revolver and cigar. I will take my squirt gun and popsicle. And now I'm realizing, like, I, I think GTA 3 is, like, semi-expensive. More than it was back in the day, if anything. Yay! It just kind of in demand. I wonder which version, like, I forgot which version of San Andreas I have. Ooh, that might be something to look up. Yeah. I'll have to, have to, I'll have to check. Like, do you have it pre-patch or post-patch? And if I do have it pre-patch... Ooh, can I get it? <laughs> I mean, it's for PS2, and I've got the uh, old trusty action replay, of course. But hmm. I don't know. I don't know how much I can do with that. All you gotta do is flip a switch, allegedly. Like, go into the command prompt and just say, Yes! I do want that. Well, coming soon on the channel, it's gonna be- FINALLY! Uh -huh, yeah. Hey, let's go back to the early days of the channel where we played, uh, Newgrounds, uh, Naughty Games. Like, like, I've seen it, it's not even good. Well, yeah, it's- it's on the PS2. You got- you can get better stuff on the internet. Get some better stuff on Steam Just, that actually yeah, that's, that's that actually right. go into bargain bin lounge. That's right. Ah. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Welcome to my stepmom. Won't stop farting on me. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Don't take me back, Dude! 
<laughs> Who has nostalgia of that? Ah! <laughs> Go back to the days. My, my uncle got it for me on my 12th birthday, and well, I don't see him much anymore. Finally, Meat and Fuck Kingdom comes to the channel. <laughs> the Newgrounds classic. Yes! Finally! Do you have any, uh, prawn games on Steam? Uh, I do not. I got a couple. I got a few. I know you do. Yeah. Because they're in their own category, if memory serves. Are they? I don't know. Not, not, not in my library, but... Oh, okay, okay. I did, uh... There was a pack, the... The Sakura... F pack games that came, like... Uh, came with, like, 15 games, and it's, like, the most boring softcore shit you've ever seen. And I got those because the pack was, like, $3 for 15 games, and I'm just padding out the collection. I, it's just... Sakura Swim Meet! It does one of those things where, it, like... I, I I played one of the first ones. It was like Sakura Spirit or whatever. Like it was like one of the very 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 first ones they ever did. And I played it through, and it just kind of stops. It does. Yes. It just a stops. majority of those games just stop. I'm like what what the hell? And then I saw that they were making another one. It's like oh that might be. And then another one came out. Yep. Oh well. The, and then another. And then another one and came then out. Another. And then another. Have it's you ever heard of infections? Mm -hmm. I, I think that's what we're dealing with right now, is a big old infection of Sakura here. I think I took an antibiotic uh, before it spread to other oh, parts oh, thank, of my, of thank my Christ. library. Oh, thank Christ. Yeah. The saved one. No! Same thing with Nekopara. Oh, the nostalgia's over. You wanna play? I think I'll play. I'll go ahead and see what we got here. Alright, uh... Oh, my rank right. sucks. Let's go. Action. Beat the clock. Go. This one's actually fun. This is, you know, keep the combo going, otherwise your timer goes all the way to the bottom and you die. Oh, I, don't, I don't want that to happen, no. No dying. Alright, uh, let's see. I actually got pretty okay. far in this mode, but there was one time where, uh, I think... If you use a hint, your timer goes down, like, a lot faster. And I got to a point where I was like, I can't see anything here. I don't need a hint, because I'm good at it. Super Turbo Power Gamer. Check it out. There was a game uh, that I had back in the day. It was uh, like a like a Sega classic pack. Volume 1! Never made a Volume 2. Very strange. <clears throat> but uh, one of the games there was Sega Swirl. Sega Swirl? Sega Swirl. That's a basically like, you know, a typical uh, matching game or whatever. Yeah, was it something like this? or it, so, Sort of. It's it's kind of like a match of things like like if I were to hit per like this purple both yeah. those purple would go away then if I, and ah you know, uh, okay so it's it's kind of like make them drop and then see if you can uh, get you know get as much as you can pop but, it but uh, here the, the trick is to tr to choose one color and group as many of them together as you can. Mm, I kind of like that. So so you like you know you, you get a couple of twos. God damn and man! You take. You take a couple of uh, hits and points all, and all that, but then when you get them all grouped together, you hit them once, and you get, like, 400,000 yeah. points right there. Yeah! I like games like that. When number go up, Niski happy. Yes. Positive reinforcement is always good. I think PopCap was extremely good at positive reinforcement. Like, when we played Peggle 2, hitting that last peg and then the music kicks in, it's just like, <gasps> I did that! And then right here, it's just like level complete and explosions all over the place. I did that. I made the level complete. I made Boom Boom, literally. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you got me, uh, you got me thinking. Uh, the, uh... I have that effect on people. As you just get people thinking, and it's weird. Think thoughts. Uh, uh the... GameCube, PS2, Xbox generation. Yes. I remember vividly on how I got every single one of those. Like, we talked about how Uncle sold me his PS2, and I was like, oh, wow, that was the last one I got out of the other ones. I got that at a uh, video store. A friend of mine helped me get it. Nice. We don't talk much anymore. All right. Good transaction, but yeah. <laughs> otherwise. Yes. But uh, I got my GameCube for... I think it was, like, when I was in middle school? GameCube was a birthday present. Yeah. Mine too. Coming home from like the uh, end of school one day, and then uh, there, there, there's the GameCube with Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. Good shit. 
Mine uh, came with uh, Spyro, Enter the Dragonfly, and Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers. That's rough. I'm sorry, buddy. So that night I went and bought uh, Smash Melee and Mario Sunshine. <laughs> That's rough, buddy. I'm so Oh, wait. Th those are good games. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember my Xbox, however. <laughs> my Xbox was a Christmas present. And what my family does is uh, my dad has uh, two brothers. And normally when it came to getting a big gift for the kids, you know, like a bike or a DVD player or something like that back in the day, it was always, hey, why don't we combine forces and buy the gift that way? The Xbox was such a commodity, such a high-priced, hard-to-find item that year <laughs> that when they ordered it, it wasn't going to be here in time for Christmas. So they literally wrapped a box with an X on it and said it's on its way. <laughs> so I got it. I got an Xbox for Christmas, and then the real thing came like a month later or something like that. I got my 360 for Christmas. At least the first one. Yeah. I, it, it's, it, I can't remember the other ones after that. Yeah, I think... Uh, I, I remember I had to send that first one away to a, to a, a repair place. Mm -hmm. And after a few days, they're like, Yeah, we can't fix this. We'll just send you a, a refurbished one. After, uh, after my first 360 had a couple red rings of death, go, you know, sending it in, getting it fixed, and all that fun stuff... Um, eventually the Slim came out, and that's the one I actually still have. That's good to know. And it's a pretty reliable console, you know, it's stood the test of time. Because they actually figured out how to make the Xboxes not bork. Oh, they figured out how to, how to make a console now? F fucking finally, it only took them till the Series X. I mean, uh, uh, you know, the even 360 then, Slim, Red yeah, Fox even then. <laughs> But the funny thing is, I, I sold my, my other one, my old white one with the face plates and everything. Mm -hmm. And... Every single console generation after that, I have always gone for the slim version, and that's the one I've kept. Except for the Xbox One. I still have the VCR. <laughs> that's the one you used for uh, Banjo-Kazooie. That was indeed. Well, he's got a big hate boner for uh, for Microsoft, so when I brought that home, he was like, What's that? He's <laughs> like, oh, it's an Xbox. I'm using it for, for Banjo. It's like, it's, it's a fucking VCR, I know. <laughs> Did you actually hear that uh, they're not updating the, the VCR models anymore? So eventually it will have... Uh, it will be antiquated much like the VCRs. Yep. Which I thought was kind of sad, because um, when Gears 4 came out, I got the uh, the slim Xbox One, which is still a great console. It roars every time I turn it on, and it's really stupid. <laughs> it's more like a screech or anything like that. Yeah, it's supposed to mimic one of the monsters. Wow, that's so that's so funny, Xbox. It's hilarious. I think for what this... What about the one that doesn't work? Oh, the VCR? <laughs> no, no, no. no oh, okay, okay. Oh, you, you I'm, meant Xboxes. I'm, I'm, oh. I'm, I'm having a laugh at the expense of Microsoft. I see how it is. <laughs> Actually, uh, for the Series X, I don't think I'll ever go for any slim model ever, just because it was impossible to find when I got mine. And I got it for Resident Evil Village. <laughs> So I'm like, oh, I'm okay. I don't need another one. So I, I bought my PS3 by myself. Mm -hmm. See, I've, I've been more gravitated towards Sony between the two of us. That's where we that's where we diverged in our gaming paths. Where we fight after long nights. And <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> so I had bought my PS3 for myself because you know I, I you know it's it's time. I got I got some spending money. Mm -hmm. I, I got a good deal. Three hundred bucks got me a fucking PS3. But nice. yeah. And it was like, now I can get all these games that I want. I got like 2012. I, got, I can get all these games I've, I've always wanted to play. I get you know, Metal Gear Solid 3, Heavy Rain, uh, Lollipop, Lollipop Chainsaw just came out. You know, that's, that, that'd, be, that, that'd be fucking great, yeah. Uh, 3 or 4? MGS. MGS 4. There we go. Because I love 3 so much, right? Oh! And I haven't bought myself a PlayStation since then. Where? V Vita, birthday gift. Vita, uh, birthday gift. PS4, Vibot that. For Christmas, hmm. then a uh, PS5. So uh, it was when it was it, it was kind of scarce, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. and uh, it it was around my birthday about like a couple years ago. 
My mom's like, well, I, I want to get you a PS5. That's right. I remember that. It's like, it's like, uh, oh, are you sure? It's like, yep, yep. That's it's no problem. You know, you know I got, I got some, some money, and dad think, dad think it's, you know, it's like, okay, all right. So uh, I was, I was ready. I was, I was ready to, to. Okay. Looking at, looking at all those, those, those sites that uh, alert you when a PS5 is, is dropping. Mm -hmm. like, okay, I got a couple of feeds, a couple of things on there. It's like I'm ready to go. Later that day, it's like, okay, found one. I'm like what? <laughs> It's like, Mom, you didn't have to pay 700 bucks for one? Oh, come on. Oh. Now, your mom's hilarious because... But it came with another controller, so... Oh, that's, so that's, nice. that's good. That's good. Yeah, your your mom is always hilarious when it comes to, like, gaming stuff that she gets you. Because most of the time, it it goes down to, uh, oh, you want this? He's like, yeah, but it's it's kind of expensive. She's like, no, I already bought it. It's, it's fine. What? It's like, I, come I, I, on. Mom, come on. <laughs> come on, Ma. Jeez. Ma. Come on. Now I've uh, I've pretty much purchased every console. Like after the GameCube, Xbox, PS2 era. Um, yeah, it's like because everything gaming I want, I can get for myself now. Right, you don't have to rely on. And I think she Christmas. took that personally. <laughs> <laughs> You're still my child. I'm buying you but, gamer but, stuff. But I, but I can do it myself, mom. It's okay. It's 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 fine. Be happy. <laughs> I am because I buy things myself now. I got my own money. No, I still love. I that, have more uh, discerning tastes. I was, uh, uh... I think I'm fucked. Uh, yeah. I think, I, I'm, I think it's it's that time. I think I'm fucked, people. No! Uh, well, that's alright. Pretty decent score. You got a better rank than I did. I was in bad. the 300Ks. Not too bad. Now, you had some dirty combos going. Those are great. What's puzzle, though? Uh, puzzle is, uh... Yeah, just that. You need to figure out what to kill. And you need to uh, clear the entire stage. You got it. Yeah, easy. As easy as that. Yep. Hmm. Try uh, moving it to the left. Nice. Hmm. All right, now down. No, the other down. D D D D D down. Bits over. Move on. D -d -d down, 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 down. Select new puzzle pod from the left. Yep. Uh. Hey. Uh. Right bumper. There you go. Oh. Yeah. There you go. Oh. Those oh. are those are your puzzles. Oh. Then we move on to oh. another planet. Oh. Okay. All right. 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 Good luck. So like that. Awesome. Except not. And then like that. Undo. Undo. You can't win. Oh. There you go. Don't me to life. There you go. There you go. Ah. Uh. There you go. <laughs> you uh. did it. Ah. Uh. I see. I see. Go fuck yourself. It pulled a fast one on you. All right. What's this one here? Hmm. Uh. This one just seems odd. It does. I see what they want you to do, bro. That? Uh, that's a big old no, yeah, friend. I don't, I don't think that's it. Big old no, me bucko. You're right. You're right. You just somehow get that orange over here somewhere. I think you might have to move that middle triangle on the third row all the way on the left. This one? Yeah. Right there? Move that. Um, so there goes that one. Okay. This is awful. I don't know. <laughs> Ooh, uh, may I? Yeah, go ahead. Let's see if I can figure this out. Uh, boom. Failure. Mm. Uh, how about this? Oh, wait a minute. We gotta get crazy with Was those. Was that not it either? I think we gotta get crazy. We gotta, we gotta somehow get that blue over to those uh, chrome ones as well. Shit! Yeah, you're right. Uh. So move, yeah, move that over, and then move it over again. Oh, okay. Yeah, there we go. You had to get a little cuckoo bananas. Shit! 
<laughs> Need to get a one of these over here. And then one of these over here? Zap zap zap. No. Fuck. This one's probably like stupid uh, easy. Uh, let me see. You got one? I think, I think I got an idea. There you go. Try that. Let's see. If I do this, one of those. Yeah? Right? Yeah? Yeah? And then and one of these, it over. Like that. And then kill it. And one of those, right? Yeah. Okay. And one of these, right? And one of these, right? And one of these. Okay. Still have an issue. Uh, one of these. One of these. Fuck. Oh, uh, kill the green. Move white over. Now kill the red. Yeah! Good job, man. <laughs> Alright, one more puzzle. It worked me anyway. You went to the wormhole. Easy shit. Yeah, boom! Wait. Oh, it was an example. Thirteen planets left! Oh, this one seems fairly easy. Yeah, it's just explaining how rocks work. Boom. 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 And then... Boom! Boom! Ha -ha! There you go. Easy. Nope. Fuck. There you go. Now you're getting it. Now you're getting it. Now you're getting it. Now he's got it! I got it! This goes! <laughs> I'm glad you were able to solve the... Infinite Mind Melter, known as Bejeweled. You failed! Bejeweled 2. What are you doing? Boom! Ferg. Boom. Boom. Ferg. Boom. Ferg. Oh, uh, you might have had it, actually. Do oh. that again. And then move the bottom one, where the rocks are, up. Fuck! Here, let me get it. I want to play. <laughs> Get my turn to play. Fuck! That's exactly the same thing you did. I right, have about this? And then that, how about this, though? And that. And then how about this, though? Yay! Yay! Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fail so spe spectacularly right at the beginning. Fuck! So that needs to be a double bomb. Ah, there we go. Ah! Mm -hmm. Need some deep meditation here for Bejewel to... Ooh, 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 ooh. He can't be stopped. He can't be stopped. Hell yeah! Alright. Did you, hit, did you hit LB real quick? LB? Warp yeah! See you next week on Bargain Bin Lounge! Man, I just want to keep playing Bejeweled 2. I man. know, I, I know. Well, I, well, you can just keep playing. It's actually really fun, because yeah. now, now it's your turn to come up with a game. Well, it is. It is. You might be able to come up with something. I have faith in you. I think I got something. Alright. Okay. Yeah, all right. All right. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay. Okay. That was, yeah. That was actually fun talking to the past with you. Yeah, it was. It was a good time. And hey, you know, that's what we're still doing to this day. You know, or something sentimental, I'm sure. Hey, share your past in the comments below. Yeah. Genuinely curious. How'd you get your consoles? How'd you get your favorite consoles of all time? See you then. See you then. Back to the past. Mm -hmm.